Welcome to New York City and the Rockefeller Lego store. I'm Joshua Hamlin and I've got some international fan media here. So if you want to introduce yourself real quick. Good to see you again. I'm Andrews from Zusammengebaut. <laughs> I live in Hamburg, Germany. That's right. So we're just going to walk yeah. on into the Lego store here and give you a look at all of the giant models they have on display here. Some of the really unique stuff. Let's step in. This way. All right. Hello, how are you? Good to see you. Let's start over here. So if we head this direction, then we've got giant. This is a, a model, I believe, of Rockefeller Center. So I think you can see the, the ice skating rink down there. And then you've got all sorts of fun details in here with the minifigs. And uh, also, what catches your eye here? I think um, we see the whole Rockefeller Center here with all the buildings, which is pretty cool. I mean, the Christmas tree is missing. It's not Christmas, obviously. <laughs> But you have kind of a skating area right there. Mm -hmm. The statue that you get some Batman reference looks like there's uh, some Gotham City stuff in there. The giant buildings got kind of giant gray sky skyscrapers here. And you got Spider Man swinging between a couple buildings. And of course, the Lego stores downstairs. Yeah, that's very cool. This so is fun. That's all of Rockefeller Center. Well, let's, let's walk to the rest of the store and see what else we've got. Important to see all the mosaics up there. Which are pretty cool, I think, because kind of there are not so many colors inside. Classical art type of mosaics. And then, of course, you've got Lego sets all around as well, so city theme and everything else here. This seems to be the Big Apple. Yes, that is. Well, we're in the Big Apple, so it works well. Over here, we've got the giant statue, the, a Lego version of the statue you see in Rockefeller Center. This is uh, a few brown bricks were used in this, I think. Maybe a couple brickling quarters. Just brown and black. <laughs> it's all glued, should be. I hope so. <laughs> Favorite <laughs> animal of Joshua, the cat. <laughs> you know me so well. Yeah. <laughs> Since so many years. Look, we've got a, is this a Millennium Falcon advertisement? Sort of lays out the minifigs and the, very nice. Very slick Millennium Falcon advertisement. I like that. And this, so I think we've got both exclusive to the Lego yeah. stores here. So this is the Statue of Liberty and then just a New York minifig there with the skyline. So I think these are exclusive to the Lego stores. They are and they changed a little bit. Um, there's a new tile here with a skyline. This has been um, different in the past. And this one was like uh, sold out for two years or so. So now it's back in stock. Good to see Statue of Liberty. We'll pick maybe 10 or 20. <laughs> You gotta take them back to Germany. Yeah, of course. <laughs> For sure, we'll pick of them course. up. Pick a brick wall. So this is interesting. It's like a cylinder. It's all it's around here. What is very uh, special here that you got a lot of sand green elements. So you can, can actually buy and uh, build your own Statue of Liberty, which you can see right here. So it's um, built your own model, which is still available here in the US and not in Germany anymore. So the sand green is really fun. I think we need to go around and walk upstairs then to see. Maybe there you see. What's the name again the of our friend? Does, does he have a name? Yeah, I think so. I can't remember. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you know, you'll be on the break. We should, well, so, someone in the comments can remind us what, yeah. what the, the green guy's name is What's there. the name of the dragon? <laughs> we'll, we'll head up there. there. And this is interesting here at the mosaic. This is nice. Yeah, I love the, the lightning bolt and the clouds there. For gift right now. Here's the dog. There should there. be um, another big apple there. Ah, it's still there. Mm -hmm. We've seen this before, right there. A um, lot of minifigures. Yeah, the red ones, the yellow, the black, white, and you've got these. There you go, logo. And so that's. About it, I think for this Pretty much store, it's like two stores, it's really, really cool. This one is very nice, it's smaller than the other one, so... The Flatiron one, so there's two There's two stores we should mention in New York City, there's the Rockefeller and yeah. the Flatiron one. In Manhattan, there's, um, okay. I think one Queens, okay. but we have so two in Manhattan at least. Gotcha. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, very cool, so it's nice these Lego stores that have the, the big models in them, because a lot of them are just kind of... They, they, they look the same. They, they're just kind of the sets on display and there's not much else to see. Somehow it, it feels good because you come back and you um, think, yeah, this is a Lego store, but it's kind of different with another sculptures, another models. 
this is pretty cool here. I mean, and it's nice that you have two floors. And now we're in the Flat Iron District, and once again, I'm joined by my friend here from Zizungabad. Good to see you again. <laughs> yes, so we're, New York City. we're gonna look here at these mosaics. Before we go inside, you can see all these cool mosaics that they build up that you can see from the outside of the building. It kind of captures the iconic buildings and look of New York City. The hot dog stand, the yellow taxi, the buildings, all sorts of neat stuff. And the subway, right there. Yes, the subway, the signs there. So keep going around. We've got sort of a coffee stand there, guy drinking his coffee. I think that might be the flat iron building there. But here you see the iconic Statue of Liberty build. Uh, so you see a, a smaller one. This is actually Duplo for the base. Is the whole? I think the base is Duplo in bricks for the, the top of it. And then inside, and we'll get a better look at this inside, you can see the, the giant Statue of Liberty arm with the torch there as well. First, we'll, we'll glance at this. So this is, I think the, the new city line is sort of mountains type of stuff. And so there's uh, nature and mountains uh, more focused in, the, in this city theme and it looks like they had a build event here with kids so you can see the kids creations in the front there as well from the build event. And we have to mention that this store is actually um, new so open since three years I guess. Yeah this is a lot newer than the Rockefeller yeah. Center and one. And larger as well so. Exactly so we'll head in here and in the door Thank go ahead. Thank you so ahead. much. You're welcome. Hello guys, welcome. So as we mentioned, you can see, we'll start with the giant torch here. It's got lights in the top there, so it has kind of the flame effect going on. Mosaic there. Yeah, really neat mosaic at the bottom. I like that. There's lots of the little one by one pieces for the detail and stuff. Some brick built mini figs. Those are really cool. I like this. This is one of the more impressive models in the store right here, in my opinion. And then if you look to our, our left here, kind of up above the the left side, uh, the right side as you walk in, there's a timeline that lays out, I think it's the history of this, this area, Fifth Avenue area of New York City. And that little challenge for your viewers, there's a mistake in this clock. So find it out, leave a comment. <laughs> find the mistake in the clock, leave a comment below, yeah. that's right. <laughs> Show it for a sec and there's a mistake inside. But yeah, so the timeline has all these giant brick built minifigs in it. So we start with today at this end and then we kind of move down going backwards in time over the last few centuries and showing how the area has, has evolved over the years. So that's that's really cool and just some excellent building work there to get the posable minifigs and everything. Right now you're getting a nice extra here in New York City, in the US I think. Year of the dog. Yes, so I believe an $88 purchase will get you the dog set. Wow. So also in the middle area here is the giant brick built logo. So the, the Rockefeller Center one had the one that's with minifigs. This is just normal pieces. System and technique pieces, yeah. I think. So, so nice it's a, to see. A different take on it. Looks great. The pick a brick wall again with Obviously many sand amazing. green elements. Amazing elements here at the pick a brick wall. I think this is smaller, right? Than the pick a brick. It seems like it, but the other one, the Rockefeller one, is laid out in a way that may, I don't know. It seems larger, maybe. So it's, it's hard to tell. But yeah, this this one does seem a little smaller. Good stuff there. So it has the pick a model thing here so you can build your own Statue of Liberty. That's why there's so many sand green elements here so you can... All the curves elements here are really great too. And all sand green. You might be taking some of those back with you to Germany. I will <laughs> buy five cups right now <laughs> after we've done this here. So once again, the timeline up here, we get back in the 1800s and all the way back to the 1700s. And Joshua, one question. What is the name of the dragon right there? <laughs> <laughs> Someone, I'm sure, will let us know. Yeah. We still haven't figured it out. <laughs> Got displays, Star Wars City displays. And then there's actually room even further back here in this store if we keep going. That's a like, yeah, kind of brick built. <laughs> what Which is, is that? funny? A brick built. Oh, right. So, so they're planting the brick there. Some butterflies to the left of that. This is built by some model builders here. It's nice. Got the friends section, come over here, you got this some technique. Actually a nice way to display the Millennium Falcon. And you can look inside. Okay, there's glass also. <laughs> it's only if, you, if you're tall enough like you. Look over the top. There's gold inside, I can see it. There's gold inside. <laughs> <laughs> only a select few. So then we, is out there. we go through this arch back here and you've got kind of a, another build area room in the back. 
Gandalf? Yes. Lower, massive build there. He's standing on a brick. I like how he's attached to the brick like that. That's really realistic. It looks just like a minifig. And then here is a brick build area like the Rockefeller Center had, uh, you know, brick build area of that. So then you get the flat iron building here and this whole area around the Lego store has been built up with minifigs and lots of fun details everywhere. Very important is the swimming pool on top of the building here. <laughs> so right now it's really important. <laughs> Here's a friends minifig and then the dad. Awesome stuff on the shelves. What do, let's start with here. We got a clock. This clock looks like it's not, does not messed up at all. This is fine. <laughs> <laughs> then the globe, the globe's really neat. And then the duck here, which is a throwback to the original like, wooden duck that Lego first started making with the wooden toys. So if you've seen that. Then here's some like bookends with Lego books. So it's using simple kind of plate and brick stacking to make the make the books that's always a cool technique I like that so you got brick wallpaper in here quotes on the walls this is the whole like building inspiration area so of, of the two Lego stores we've been to with Rockefeller and this one which one is your favorite this one it's larger there's more to see more sculptures and I think this is a nice place to go mm -hmm. and I will fill a few cups right now with brick <laughs> and we have one thing to show John I think which is important yeah, this definitely has a newer feel than the Rockefeller one. You can yeah. feel it built much more recently, so that's that's nicer. So when you come here and visit New York City, gotta gotta show you have the, to pick yes. up some of those. Gotta get the exclusives. You can get it here only in the two stores in Manhattan. So the Statue of Liberty, or there's another one right here. The New York guy with the skyline again. There you go. So Very make sure cool to pick stuff. up those exclusives if you're in New York City checking out the Lego stores. So I hope you enjoyed that look at the Lego store here in the Flatiron District. It is a lot of fun. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for having me. <laughs> Definitely. Thanks for watching, everyone.